So today I'm out here in Merlin, Oregon. I had a call from this gentleman asked me if I could install an antenna for him. He said he was using one of those indoor antennas and it did pick up some of the channels but it was unreliable and he wanted to know if I could get him more channels than he was presently getting. So the first thing I did was I hooked up a little tripod and a temporary antenna so I could figure out if I was going to be able to do that much good for him. I had this thing on a tripod. That's what I like to do before I uh, ask anybody to commit to having me install an antenna. I want to verify ahead of time what I'm capable of getting. Anyway, so the situation is this. The most important channel he wanted to be able to pick up is in this direction here. And that's the front of the antenna, by the way. A lot of people get it backwards. They think the, the front of the antenna is the direction that the arrow is pointing. It's the complete opposite. Anyway, uh, so yeah, the main, the main signal he wanted to get was channel 26. That's a Fox uh, network in this direction here. And some of the others were in this direction. And then channel 10 was in the complete opposite direction. But channel 10 was so strong, what I essentially did was figured out that I could still have the antenna going in the wrong direction and get channel 10 without too much signal loss. Whereas the uh, channel he really wanted, I had to pretty much zoom right in on it to be able to get it. So that's a compromise you often have to make when you're out doing an antenna. Of course, another option would have been to have a rotor put on this thing, in which case he could have turned it around every time he wanted to get a particular TV station to come in. But, you know, in a case like this, it's probably not going to be necessary because uh, we're getting pretty good signals now on, on every channel available in this neck of the woods. And uh, I, one thing I was a little bit concerned about was we've got the trees right here. Right now, they're somewhat barren because of the time of year but it won't be long and they'll be blooming again and I hope that's not going to be a signal um, attenuator for them. Anyway, I guess we'll find out. Uh, anyway, so for what it's worth, I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. As always, if you like it, please give it a thumbs up.